expand President Trump during his previous visit to Phoenix Mesa Gateway Airport while campaigning for president in 2015. Gage Skidmore, Flickr President Donald Trump is scheduled to hold a campaign rally in Mesa on Friday to encourage supporters to vote for Republicans in the midterm elections, including Arizona Senate candidate Martha McSally. His campaign announced on Saturday that the rally will take place at 7 p.m. at International Air Response, located at Phoenix Mesa Gateway Airport. In a statement, the Trump campaign said that the event will mark his second rally in Mesa and his tenth in Arizona since he launched his campaign for president in summer 2015. Trump previously rallied at Phoenix Mesa Gateway Airport in December 2015. His most recent rally in Arizona during summer 2017 ended in chaos, as police in riot gear deployed tear gas and pepper balls on demonstrators who had amassed outside of the Phoenix Convention Center. At that campaign rally, which occurred on the heels of the white supremacist rally in Charlottesville, Virginia, Trump floated a pardon for former Maricopa County Sheriff Joe Arpaio, which Trump later delivered. In a media release, Trump campaign chief operating officer Michael Glasner said that in Mesa, the president will celebrate the success of the booming Trump economy that's delivering new jobs and bigger paychecks to the hardworking men and women of the Great state of Arizona, President Trump will also urge your residents to get out and vote on November 6 to protect and expand our Republican majorities in the House and Senate, including supporting Martha McSally in her race for the U.S. Senate, Glasner said in the statement. McSally is locked in a toss-up race with Democratic candidate Kirsten Sinema that could determine whether Republicans hold on to their majority in the U.S. Senate. A spokesperson for McSally's Senate campaign did not immediately respond when asked whether McSally plans to attend the rally or whether she will deliver a speech.